move a motion on behalf of myself and the leader of the Senate, Senator Bamidele Michael Okpayemi, and of course my brother, you will recollect, sir, that two days ago I moved a motion under order 42 then, and the, it was the view of the Senate that graciously approved that I should come back with a proper motion. I will therefore come back with that proper motion on the need to celebrate and honor one of our predecessors, Senator Kunle Oyoro, who has, a, has attained the enviable milestone age of 100. If I so have your permission, Mr. President, and distinguished colleagues, I will proceed to move the motion. Distinguished colleagues, distinguished senator Sars had actually brought this up in our previous sitting and we said you come by way of motion. Is it the view of the Senate that it be allowed to proceed and move the motion? Those who are supposed to say aye, those again say nay. The aye is having. You can now proceed. Uh, the petitioner prayer would, uh, is noted. But however, because the Senate, we do not clap. We have agreed that since we don't clap, that they, my father, we have done this. Is, uh, so we have noted your additional prayer. Noted. Ulu Shora Saraki, Senate leader, Abraham Adesoya, and David Davinoni, who is later was also his classmate at Abeokuta Grammar School, among all others. All of these senators have blessed memory except the celebrant. Also aware that in addition to being a senator, Senator Kule Oyoro played very significant roles in the politics of, politics of their country, including but not limited to serving as an elected member of the Chief Rotimi Williams led Constitutional Drafting Committee, popularly called the Committee of 550 Wise Men, set up by the then Head of State, General Oshie Gopal Sojo, that drafted the 1979 Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. We further note that Senator Oyoro is an accomplished legal practitioner that was called to the English Bar in Lagos in 1955 and was enrolled at the Supreme Court of Nigeria on Thursday, 16 February 1956. He served the Nigerian Bar in various capacities, such as Chairman Lagos Branch between 1967 and 1970, first National Vice President, a member of the Council of Legal Education between 1972 and 1978. He's a member of African Bar Association, Commonwealth Bar Association and the International Bar Association. Further aware that in the 60s, this national this statesman was president of Nigerian Youth Congress, second secretary, socialist workers and farmers party of Nigeria. He was also president, Federation of Nigerian Youth. As a demonstration of his love for youth and education, he has awarded over 400 scholarships in the last 35 years among other philanthropic gestures. Further aware that this elder statesman, foremost lawyer, exemplary public servant, uncommon philanthropist, and in, an illustrious predecessor in the Senate, attained an enviable milestone age of 100, 100 years on Saturday, 28th October 2023, having been born on Sunday, 28th October 1923. Congressors of the need to celebrate and honor this truly distinguished Senator Kunle Oyero, Senator Kunle resolves to number one, acknowledge Senator Kunle Oyero's immense contributions to our dear country in various capacities, particularly as a senator in the Second Republic. We also resolve to celebrate and honor him in the plenary with a symbolic motion to mark his 100th birthday and a congratulatory letter from the President of the Senate to Senator Euro. Last but not the least, to honor the invitation and send a delegation of the Senate to attend a colloquium to mark the centenary's birthday on Saturday, 11th November 2023 in Abeokuta, the capital of Ogun State. Mr. President, the three colleagues, I enlist your support for this motion when we celebrate a predecessor, we're not just celebrating an individual, we're celebrating the institution of the Senate. This man is the last man standing among his colleagues who served in the Senate in the Second Republic. 
is 100 years of age, is still kicking. He has invited us to join him for the celebration on 11th November 2023. Mr. President, the senior colleague, I so move. Co-sponsors of this motion. And this motion is essentially to celebrate one of our predecessors that was in the Senate from 1979 to 1983. Yoro was a member of the Senate in the Second Republic, 1979 to 1983, representing Ogun Central Senator. Distinguished colleagues, I rise to support the motion raised by Distinguished Senator Salisu. that we should honor our former colleague, uh, Senator Kunle Oyeru, who distinguished it himself in the Senate from 1979 to 1983. I do so in the knowledge, sir, that the role played by our forebears in history sets a foundation for what we are here today. And so to continue to honor those living and those gone should remain a fundamental principle of this house. I therefore rise to support this motion, sir. Thank you, Mr. President. Ms. Oyewumi Olalele, I represent also West Central District of Osu State. Mr. President, I rise to lend my voice to the motion moved by uh, Senator Schweib on the, our leader, Senator Oyeru. Uh, Mr. President, distinguished colleagues, Senator Oyeru, I know him very well because uh, he's one of our political repositories in the Southwest. He's a frontline politician and thoroughbred politician. Very versatile and very, very tough. As in the in the working realm of Baba Desaya. If you are with him as a politician, it's like you are at the university. The short man is still alive for 100 years. It's even worth celebration on his own. And as a former member of the Senate, once a senator, a senator for life. It's a great honor to be done to this chamber. If you are honoring part, we have a part of a celebration for 100 years. And I think I uh, wish him well. I support the motion that we should be part of that and come on. I will celebrate him uh, for 100 years in office as a member of this government. I so second. Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, thank you, distinguished colleagues. Uh, I rise to support this motion to honor our predecessors that set the foundation for democracy in this country. Why I rise up particularly, sir, is 1979, I was a returning officer. I was an electoral. Follow the procedure. My name is... <laughs> uh, distinguished Senate President, sorry, colleagues. My name is Garba Musa Maidoki, Senator representing KB South Senatorial District. Sorry for that omission. Uh, I'm in support of the motion for supporting those who lay the foundation of democracy for this country. And I'm particularly happy today that I'm here because 79, I was an electoral officer. I was a polling unit presiding officer. And uh, I remember with nostalgia, the, my colleagues, that during that election, election ballot were in bundles like money with serial numbers with uh, counterfoils that after election you return these materials back those that were every uh, ballot paper had a serial number and uh, it was one of my first experience of election and uh, it was an election that was held well and I think it's an election that we need to emulate those foundations that we set should be emulated so that our election can continue to improve with, as time goes by. Thank you very much. I so su support, sir.